The Young Curators is a voluntary program involving secondary school children working with an important Australian artist where they host an exhibition of that artist at their school. It was quite uh, an amazing experience to see uh, the, the, not just the skill level but just the input and just how intelligent the thinking was behind their decision making. So I've got to say that not only do I put a lot in but they put a lot in. So yeah, it was, it was a great thing to do. We take them to art fairs as well as to our own shows for 333 art projects where they can see non-traditional settings. They can spend time with leading artists in their studios, learning all about the creative process. So I got involved in the Young Curators Initiative to learn about how curation works. You know, it's, it's more than just hanging a painting on a wall. And you get to see their studios and their works, you get to see how curation works, you know, just you get the power to decide what gets put in a gallery, what themes goes on. This just seems like a, a perfect way of really helping to sustain Australian art and helping with the education of young people. That's really important to us. My favourite part has been uh, probably working with the artists, not just Jasper, but some of the other artists we've been able to meet. Reg Mombasa was amazing. He's one of my favourite artists. The main thing I've taken from Jasper is just to have fun when you do your work. Um, a lot of art, I think, now is really tied down with being heavy, whereas this sort of lets you see all the behind the scenes works, what's going on, the creative processes, which is really the most important part of the artwork, is how it's created and why it's created. The Young Curators has been very rewarding for me personally, watching these kids respond to it. The Young Curators is all about the experience. There's no doubt that this this program is important for the next generation of kids because when I grew up I didn't have a network like this or a support system like this. You need a network and you need FaceTime and you need cross-pollination and without professional experience and without actually these valuable experiences, how would children know that this is a, something they could do? That's why it's important. We're opening the students' minds to different levels of creative thinking with the view that they will take this into the future.